Woodrow Wilson Hall, formerly known as the Shadow Lawn Mansion, was built in 1929 at a cost of $10.5 million. The mansion stands upon the precise site of the original Shadow Lawn, which was destroyed by fire in 1927. It was later purchased by Joseph B. Greenhut. Greenhut loaned the mansion to President Woodrow Wilson during the campaign of 1916 as the presidential summer home. Thereafter, it was known as the Summer White House. Many claim that the souls of the former residents still wander around Wilson Hall at night. Numerous students have reported some sort of paranormal activity throughout their time at Monmouth. The elevator stopped on me once when I was a freshman, but it was well before I ever knew anything about the ghosts at Monmouth, so I never really thought of it. Um, I guess it could have been Woodrow, you know pissed off that we're all using this elevator or something, but I really can't, uh, I really can't tell you if that's him, to be honest. I was in the Wilson Hall Chapel with my sorry sister throughout a ceremony, and we were just sitting there, and the candle blew out, and we thought, okay, maybe there's a draft or something, so we went around, and we checked all the windows, we checked the vents, there was no draft coming through the room, and we relit the candle, and then about two minutes later, we were sitting there, and it blew out again. This is when we started getting really creeped out. And then we, we relit it another time, and it blew out again. And we were, like, we were freaking out, and there was really no explanation for it, and I haven't been back here since. It just creeps me out, and I get weird vibes. When we were going through pictures that we had taken of Wilson Hall, we found orbs in several of the pictures, like the glowing orbs that they talk, or like, you know, ghosts, or other kind of like activity. We would feel like I'd walk into the room and it would be right before one of our events and suddenly we'd feel a very cold air. Piano playing in, uh, in Wilson Hall uh, at that mezzanine. That, that's about it. I think they're very benevolent ghosts. I don't think it's to hurt anybody. I think it's just to help help guide you fellow Monmouth University Hawks. Despite numerous reports of paranormal activity, there are some who do not believe it at all or are skeptical about the hauntings at Wilson. Uh, I am often asked if uh, Wilson Hall is haunted. Uh, I am here late all the time. Uh, my answer is no. I, I've never witnessed anything firsthand. Working here, I mean, like, no, I don't like walk in and see Casper walking through the hallway, like, hey, what's up, man? But the closest thing to haunt it that I get rather regularly is working very late. Nobody's here. It's very quiet and the police department at the university think it's quite funny to walk as quietly as they can along the third floor until they get to the door and they pound on it as hard as they can to jar me out of my chair and scare the hell out of me. I've been there stumbling around many nights. I might have seen stuff, but I couldn't say I was in a sober state of mind to actually say that it was or was not a ghost. Many feel that the reason for these hauntings is because of the rich history both bad and good, of the mansion and Shadow Lawn. This place definitely has history. Because it is sacred ground, it is an old place, so I think they just want to make sure everything's still intact like it was in the early 1900s. Stuff, I see old presidents' names, and there's weight to paper like that. I think that, you know, my belief in ghosts isn't necessarily if there's this whole paranormal thing, but there's history, and when there's history in things, it's, it carries weight, it carries people, it carries lives. And there's really no explanation to these things, but, you know, uh, paranormal activity, I guess you could say it. I mean, I, I, I believe it. I don't, you know, I don't knock it. So. I think that I've had some experience with ghosts. It was weird, you know, it feels like there's stuff here. I mean, even every day at work, this office has been inhabited for, you know, years and years and years. You can tell that there's been a lot of people here. Now it is up to you. When studying at Wilson Hall, think twice about those noises you hear or the shadows you see. Is it just your mind playing tricks on you, or could it be the spirits that haunt Shadow Lawn? Yeah, I do remember this, uh, this one professor that stuck out. He was a bit of an oddball. He, uh... His name started with a D. I'd say it was 2007 was his first semester ever there. I, it's weird. I think he he transferred from Rutgers or something. He was a great guy, but you know, I think he had a little paranormal activity going around. I don't know. You either followed him around or 
anything, you know, mishaps in the middle of class for no reason, lights wouldn't work, projectors stopped working, middle of, middle of him showing us videos. I think the immersion. 